Hey guys, uh, in this video, I'm gonna introduce you to how to config your uh, rebalancing bot. So we have learned about rebalancing technique uh, before, right? So now I'm gonna guide you through how to set it up and make the bot trade. Uh, just, uh, just to let you know that I'm um, basically I'm not a programmer. My my base is trader, so if the code look weird or something, so just tell me and maybe you should guide me if I can make something better in this code. So by the way, the course <clears throat> the code work perfectly fine. So if you uh just make a setting like I'm like I am gonna show you so it could be fine it could be work perf uh, properly so <clears throat> let's see uh what you should do is go to just file oh no before everything else you should install python so my code is built on python and using ftx exchange so you should have ftx account if you don't have an account, you can register through my left link to get 5% off and I can answer your question. So I'm using Python version 3.9. So if you don't have Python, just install it and just install the package. Uh, using pip install, you, you can find it about a uh, package install in the internet. So here is all the package you gonna use. So just install this package and let's see the config. So when you have an FTX account, you can get your API key and secret key. So uh, I'm gonna show you. Let me go to my FTX account. So here. In your FTX account, you can go to setting and go to API tab and you can, you can create API key for your account. Uh, the best thing of FTX is you can have your sub account, which is separate from your main account. So I've had a lot of, uh, sub account. So you can create API key here and copy API key and, oh, sorry. And, and, Put it here and put your secret key here and put your sub account name here. So that's all. And just name your account, your bot account. So everything you, you, you can name, name your bot, everything. And the pair you want to trade, if you want to trade Bitcoin, so you can just put BTC USD here. And the token name is BTC, right? And I put an example of the config here. So if you don't not so sure what to put in here, so you can go to the example config. And here is the rebalance percentage. In last video, I talk about rebalancing technique. I fixed the uh, percentage at 50%, right? So it's going to be uh, 0 0.5. And minimum diff percentage is is if the asset value move about uh i don't know 0 0.5 percent right it's gonna leave the last one time so you can set it at uh one percent or two percent or anything what this mean this mean if you fix is at has at 50 right Fix at 50%, I'm going to just uh, type it here. If you fix it at 50% and your asset is, if you set this at 1%, okay, mean 1%. So if you fix it at 50% and your asset is 59%, it's going to rebalance, it's going to make a uh, transaction, make, make a trade, I mean. And if you, uh, set it at 2% when the asset price is below, uh, sorry, if your asset value is below 48, it's gonna liberalize it. So 
that is quite simple. And by the way, you should you should be careful because and we talk about in the last video that maybe the minimum asset value let me see ah okay let's see doc yeah. the minimum asset to trade for dog is one right so the value the minimum value should not uh below 0 0.5 that's mean in here in your setting oh sorry in your setting if your capital is uh let's say one thousand you shouldn't set the minimum uh mean diff percentage here below uh if you set set it at two point five percent so it's gonna be uh okay let's let make it two point five percent so every twenty five uh buck is gonna be balanced if you set it at uh zero every two point five buck is gonna be balanced right but if you set this too low too low i mean if you set it like a let's say zero that is really low, right? If if you set it too low, it's gonna rebalance every two point uh twenty five percent. But that is possible, right? Because the minimum <coughs> uh diff is gonna be one unit at zero point five uh zero point fifty. Oh, I mean fifty three. Yeah. Oh, sorry for my English. <laughs> By the way, and um, yeah, just to let you know, you you shouldn't have set it too low. By the way, it's based on your your capital. If your capital is one million, <laughs> let's say, so it <clears throat> is uh, not so wrong if you set it because zero point zero zero uh zero point zero five uh twenty five is two fifty buck. So it's, it's so big, right? So it's depend on many things. It's depend on the minimum trading size of your asset and your capital. Okay. And that's all. You can just go back to the main script and, uh, run your Python script and boom, finish. So here and, uh, as far as I know, there is no bug because I have used by myself. So, if you find any bug or have any suggestion, so you can, uh, oops, you can PM me in my page or just leave a comment in this video. So, thank you for watching, everyone. I don't know why this keep me to save something, so I won't save it. Okay, see you in ne next video, guys.